Life is about handling your responsibilities. Get it done, no excuses, do it. And don't listen to me, listen to the author. They will tell you the same thing. <laughs> Keep watching to find out what book I'm talking about today. Hey y'all, it's Kyla Denanyo, and today I am talking about taking a stand and getting it done, okay? So today we're talking about the book, XOXO Cody. The author of the book is Cody Rigsby. The genre of the book is nonfiction. The theme of the book is biography, okay? I didn't know who Colin Rigsby was. I choose my books by their covers or if someone recommends it. This one is amazing. Come on, how could you not pick this up and read it? Let's see what Cody is about. So there's a quote in the book, okay? I saw the truth in front of me, so I handled it. And that literally could be the theme of the entire book, okay? When Cody says that quote, he is talking about having to work multiple jobs so that he can help his mom pay rent and in some occasions pay for the whole rent himself. He grew up in North Carolina. He didn't have the most stable household, but he needed to handle stuff to get things done. Was it fair? No. Was it the way he would have preferred it to be? I don't know, but did he handle it? Yes, he saw what was in front of him and he handled it, right? One of the things I love about this book is that Cody is constantly and consistently challenging himself to do new things, okay? So I'm reading the book, I take a break to look up Dancing with Stars. I don't watch that show. And I'm watching clips of him dancing, I'm watching clips of when he had Corona-19 and so he and his partner had to dance from their house and my daughter comes along, we're both watching, I'm like, wow, look at him, oh my gosh. Okay, huge celebrity, big personality, right, loves to dance. He actually wanted to be a dancer and on Broadway and all this stuff. And so he's always kept himself fit and what happens is someone tells them that they're auditioning for fitness and it turns out to be Peloton way, way back, early Peloton. And he's like, okay, I'll go out for it. My body always is in shape because he keeps his body conditioned for dancing. And he goes out, he gets it. He's like, okay, so I got the job. But as is the case in the book, he had to handle it. Well, he had an audition, but it wasn't the best. He had to do it again and come correct and handle it. So he starts doing his videos, but he's not getting all the views. He had to watch other people and study and then he handled it, right? He at all times is aware of what is happening. His eyes are open. He wants to know the truth. He wants you to tell him the truth and he will handle it once he sees it. And let me tell you, I stand somebody who does that, <laughs> okay? He's aggressive in life. He is aggressive in life, okay? I have this saying and my friends laugh. When people are passive aggressive, it makes me aggressive aggressive because like, just say what you wanna say. Let's, let's just do it, right? Cody could probably have that tattooed on him because just say it, just, just say it. Oh, my dance instructor is trying to like tiptoe around me and be some kind of way. What's the deal? I just saw you for today. So I know your attitude is not because of me. What's up? Yes, Cody. Okay. And it's not a rude way. It comes out of love because Cody doesn't want there to be any miscommunications or misunderstandings. Okay. He's honest with himself. So why not be honest with y'all? And I loved it. <laughs> I absolutely loved it. So of course I had to go back and find everything about Cody and absolutely binge it because he is absolutely hilarious, so honest and everything I strive to be, <laughs> okay? So if you're interested in another biography about someone who handles things whenever they are presented to them and embraces change, check out this book review. See you in the next one.